while you read about the friendly Germans at Volkswagen allegedly scamming emissions tests with software, you probably missed a real start to Harry Potter's cloak, the fastest human-powered vehicle, and a giant air purifier. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where the smog in China during the Summer Olympics made us feel superior about pollution for once. A giant HEPA device by Dutch designer Don Bruscard of Solar Power Road fame is up and running in Rotterdam. It's not the first giant smog catcher, but this one was crowdfunded. It works by pulling air through the center and ionizing harmful airborne particles. Positively charged bits of smog then stick to an electrode in the center and clean air goes out on its way. The 23-foot tower can purify up to 1 million cubic feet of air per hour and costs about $1,000 a year to operate. Do they make these in Beijing size? Scientists at the UC Berkeley lab are legit on the way to making Harry Potter's Cloak of Invisibility. Though they could have also done some editing in post, right? Can you see me now? Now? Okay, for real, it's the first time a 3D object has been hidden from visible light. It's a lab video, but it works. They did it by using microscopically thin film made of gold nanoantenna blocks, which are usually used in solar panels. Here's hoping it's first made for Harry Potter fans rather than super fighter aliens who crave the taste of man flesh. This ain't your grandpappy's penny farthing. It's the fastest human-powered vehicle on the planet. A team from Aero Velo built the 85 mile per hour ETA bicycle as part of the World Human Powered Speed Challenge. It all went down in Battle Mountain, Nevada. To win, the team had five miles to get up to speed before hitting a 200 meter qualifying stretch along the flattest stretch of road the organizers could find. And now, TLDR, where we do the week's reading for you because you theoretically have a life. The internet hive mind erupted after a 14-year-old student was arrested for showing his teachers a clock he'd made. Google Glass is relaunching as Project Aura. HP announced plans to slash 30,000 more jobs. Facebook gets a dislike button. And Whitney Houston is going on tour. And finally, there's a site dedicated to random goat gifts because you needed that. See you Tuesday. Yay! Goats.